Today's reading from Hebrews can be understood by recalling Psalm 95 read yesterday. That psalm ended with, They shall not enter my rest. This means the disobedient Israelites would not enter God's promised land. Explaining the word rest, the sacred author tells us to be obedient so as to enter heaven. From the letter to the Hebrews. While well, our promise of entrance into his rest still holds, we ought to be fearful of disobeying least any one of you be judged to have lost his chance of entering. We have indeed heard the good news as they did, but the word which they heard did not profit them, for they did not receive it in faith. It is we who have believed, who enter into that rest, just as God said. Thus I swore in my anger, they shall never enter into my rest. Yet God's work was finished when he created the world. For in reference to the seventh day, scripture somewhere says, and God rested from all his work on the seventh day. And again, in the place he referred to, God says, They shall never enter into my rest. Let us strive to enter into that rest, so that, one, so, that no one may ble- so that no one may fall in imitation of the example of Israel's unbelief. The word of the Lord.